Hello, hello. Welcome back to my channel. I am Heather Tiedman, powered by Century 21 803 Realty. Today we are driving through the Summer Lake neighborhood. Before we get started, I would like to ask that you please like and subscribe to my channel. It really helps with the YouTube algorithm, as well as knowing that these are the type of videos that you guys like to see. This video is going to be a relatively long one as it is a fairly large neighborhood. It is a master plan community, so they have a lot going on. So this is a very popular neighborhood, so stay tuned. With that being said, if you are interested in a neighborhood or you have questions about Lexington or the surrounding areas, please drop a comment below. I'm always happy to make a video on it. Or if you have a question that you know you don't want to post publicly, my contact information is actually down in the description box below um so it's a good opportunity for you know to ask those questions privately that i'm able to help you with with that being said let's jump right into it this neighborhood is beautiful so you're going to have a lot of different builders some custom homes in here um, and a lot of amenities if you are looking for a neighborhood with amenities now this is the one for you um, there is so much happening in this neighborhood. It is absolutely crazy. Uh, and to top it all off, the price point for this neighborhood with all the amenities and what all you're getting is actually pretty fantastic, if I do say so. You can actually find homes in this neighborhood in the low 300s. Occasionally, I have seen some in the past in the high twos, but it seems currently most are going to be in the low 300s all the way up to 600,000 plus, depending on the home. You're going to have a wide variety of sizes, uh, square footage wise in this neighborhood, as well as lot sizes on this side. Uh, there's a good amount of space in between homes and as we get into other parts of the neighborhood, uh, such as garden side and things like that, the homes get a lot closer together. Um, so it really depends on what you're looking for. If you're looking for a larger lot, this may be a great neighborhood. If you're looking for low maintenance and not a lot of, you know, grass to cut, then I mean, a different section of the neighborhood may be good for you. Um, while we're talking about amenities are going to go back just a second let me show you what this neighborhood has so since we are over here i'm going to cut to the chase a little bit this neighborhood does have a 15 acre stocked fishing pond as well as a clubhouse a pool a disc golf course a playground nature trails and while you're just thinking, wow, that's already a lot, they also have boat and RV storage, as well as a walking path to Beechwood Middle School. So this neighborhood has a lot to offer. And currently the HOA fee is only $600 a year. Now, granted, depending on when you're watching this, HOA fees are subject to change, but that is a lot of amenities for $600 a year. And I mean, you have the pool overlooking the pond. Like, it is absolutely beautiful over here. Um, so if you're looking for a neighborhood with a lot to do and a lot to see, this may be that neighborhood for you. Getting back to the actual homes in this neighborhood, um, we do have a very wide square footage range like I've already spoke to you about. Most are between the low 2000s all the way up to almost 5,000 square feet. So very large um, variety of homes. Then you have homes that are three bedroom all the way up to six bedrooms. So they can fit, you know, just a small family of one or a large family or five or six or seven. There is plenty of space in here for everybody. Most homes in this neighborhood are going to have fiber cement or hardy board uh, with either brick or stone. Um, then you'll also have a lot of brick homes in this neighborhood as well. They are also zoned for Lexington One schools, including Rocky Creek Elementary, Beechwood Middle, and Lexington High School. So, and the Beechwood Middle School is actually very, very close. So that could be, you know, 
a potential benefit to you if you do have a middle schooler that likes to walk to school every day. And I mentioned this in some of my videos last year around this time, but in South Carolina, during the winter months when it starts getting cold, um, our grass does go dormant. So that's why you're going to see a lot of brown grass is our, our grass just goes dormant in the winter. So that's something to keep in mind if you are visiting during those colder months that it may not be as beautiful as it is normally during the spring and summer and early fall. Back behind those houses that we're coming up on is the um, boat and RV storage. It's located back there. It's kind of hard to see, but it's, kind, it's, it's back a good distance away from the actual houses. This neighborhood is just a couple of minutes into the town of Lexington. Um, you're going to um, be maybe eight to 10 minutes from downtown, roughly the same to Sunset Boulevard. So you're not right in the middle of the craziness and traffic, but you are close enough that you're able to get there relatively quickly. As we turn the corner here, you are going to see their playground area, which is actually very cute and very nice. I mean, it has a ton of space. Sometimes in neighborhoods, we'll see just a tiny little playground and this tiny little lot, but you actually have a volleyball net as well as all this open green space. They have some soccer goalpost, and then coming up here, you have the playground. So there's a lot of space for kids to run around and play as well as maybe hit up a pickup game or two. So that's about all I have for you guys uh, as far as what I wanted to say about this neighborhood. If you have any further questions, you can always feel free to drop them down below in the comments or send me over an email, call, or text. I'm always happy to help in any way that I can. I'm going to play some music, let you guys enjoy the neighborhood, and again, just let me know if there's anything I can help you with. I am always happy to do so. Until next time, bye!